So we've got uh, Echo CTF over here. We want, what we want to do is we want to access the network. In order to access the network, we need a VPN key. So what we need to do is we need to do the following. So once we've logged into the Echo CTF website, we want to click on this icon for our profile. So go to your profile. So I think, uh, let's see what it looks like on the dashboard. So on the dashboard here, the button is located right here. It's labeled go to your profile, click on it. And then you'll see your profile over here. You wanna click on this button over here that says profile actions. So after that, you want to download Echo CTF version 2.6, version 2.5, 2.6. Uh, this might not be the current version. You wanna download the most current version. Anyways, click on that. And that's going to download the Echo CTF uh, open VPN key. So after that, it should be in your downloads folder. So if you're on Kali Linux, this is what you want to do. So you want to go into your downloads folder. And then there you're going to see the echo CTF open VPN key. What you want to do is you want to copy this into a uh, secure location. I'm going to copy this into uh, into my root directory because uh, I want to keep this VPN key safe. So I'm going to do sudo sudo mv for move echo ctf open VPN, this file right here. And we're going to move it into the root directory echo ctf ovpn. It's going to ask us for a password, provide the password. OK. And in order to start up the uh, OpenVPN connection, we're going to run the OpenVPN command. It's going to be open, so it's going to be sudo OpenVPN and then space and then the, uh, the location of the file. So we just copied it over to our root directory. So we're going to do slash root slash echo ctf dot OVP OVPN. Hit enter. And it would have asked us for a password, but because we already did sudo a little bit earlier, it just runs the command. So OpenVPN needs to be run with sudo. If you don't run it with sudo, it's not going to work because it's, um, it's a privileged program. And after we see this kind of output over here, we are now connected to the network. So now that we're connected to the network, let's go ahead and access the, um, the challenges. So we're going to go back to Echo CTF, and then we're going to navigate down to networks over here. So we're looking for the CTF beginners network, and this is where all of our challenges are going to be. So inside the networks tab here, go to CTF beginners and then click on go to network. So after that, we've got all of our challenges over here. We've got, uh, there, there are 18 of them here. And each them, each one of them is associated with a different um, private uh, private IP address. So let's see. I think we're going to solve the first challenge over here. This is the vendor challenge. Hey there, hacker frogs! Are you enjoying this workshop, learning new concepts and skills? If so, there's a way you can support the channel. And it's totally free. Just click on the subscribe button below the video. Also, click on the like button. And if you have questions or comments on this workshop, please leave them below the video. Thanks for listening. And now, back to our scheduled programming.